What's up everyone? My name is Brittany and it's so good to finally talk to y'all. I'm driving right now so bear with me but I have to get this off my chest. Um, I want to talk about the act of reparenting yourself, um, reparenting your inner child um, because a lot of people my age or even older than me, you know younger than me is one thing but older than me, listen, all that my mama did this to me when my daddy did this to me. I'm so tired of hearing that, y'all. We are old enough to be parents if we're not already parents ourselves. Like, if you don't know how to reparent yourself, this is how you need to start. You know what it's like to not be loved. So you have the advantage on other people who fear hurt and neglect and all these different things. You have that advantage. Take your take your take your weaknesses and make them your strong. I'm about to say strongnesses girl make them your make them your strongnesses look i don't know the word i don't care listen but anyways make take your take your weaknesses and make them your your strongnesses so listen why can't i think of the word strongnesses hey your weaknesses strengths 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 Take your weaknesses and make them your strength, okay? So you have the advantage in life right now, right? So you've already felt what love does not feel like, so you can only know what love does feel like. So therefore, you can exhibit that within yourself. You know what you need to be loved. Everything that you need is within you. So you know how you want to be loved. So in turn, love yourself like that. Learn to love yourself like that. Learn to do things for yourself like that. If you have children, do it for your children. It'll make you feel 10 times better and it will help you reparent your inner child. You have to work on that. You have to work on reparenting yourself and, and, and loving yourself. You have to look at it from the eye view of like, nobody taught me, but I'm gonna teach myself. Nobody taught me, so I'm gonna teach myself. Like that's a perfect example. If nobody taught you, learn yourself. You're old enough to learn now. All right, it's a, it's a very sad shame that somebody didn't. But at the end of the day, maybe somebody just didn't know how to. Take that in consideration. Take it in consideration and look at it as everybody's just giving what they're able to give. Everybody's just doing what they're able to do in their spot in life. Don't take it personal. Just grow and evolve from that. Learn. That's what life is about. It's not about being perfect. It's not about a, it's not about having it all together. It's about learning, growing, and, 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 and loving. As I'm evolving in my spiritual journey, I realize my, I, I will catch myself, you know, looking down on people. Like I just did in my one video, oh, you're simpletons. Like, they're really not though, because they're just doing what they know to do. You know what I'm saying? I guess there is a classification for people who aren't higher thinking, but at the end of the day, they're just doing what they know how to do, so I shouldn't look down on them. I think that as you and anybody evolves in their spiritual journey, there's levels. So I think the almost highest level is loving. After you learn to love yourself, then you can learn to love everybody, and then life becomes way more peaceful. I ain't there yet, and I'm not going to lie. I'm not there yet. So if you coming on here trying to learn that, negative. I'm just in my journey. Don't come here with no expectations. Don't come here like, oh, I thought that. Nah, you didn't think nothing. Because I'm telling you now, I don't do this perfectly. I'm not perfect. If I told you my life right now, which I'm not, I'm going to do that. Yeah, because I ain't comfortable. But if I told you my life, you will be like, damn, she's really holding it down. But uh, listen, I'm not perfect. So please don't come on here with that expectation. I love that you guys love me and that you think that, you know, I got it together, but I fully I don't. I was watching that video that there was no outro because my phone had died abruptly. Um, so, yeah, I just wanted to come say bye to y'all. Um, bye. Is you about to come back? Are you going to back? Are you going to come back and fuck with me? Damn, you know I got this knowledge for you. Shoot. So is you gonna come back? <laughs> I'm just joking, bye y'all.